true blood from the new world. America's Bell Aircraft Corporation sends us the Aero Cobra, a new kind of fighter. It's the first single-seat fighter with a tricycle undercarriage, so that it can take off and land fast. The Allison engine is mounted behind the pilot and gives him a better view. The nose wheel tucks up in front, and there's room for more ammunition here, too. A powerful cannon fires through the airscrew hub, two machine guns are in the nose, and four in the wings. That's the Aero Cobra. Just Cobra to the Luftwaffe, and has it got something? Looks new, doesn't she? Spot the nose-up appearance in flight, and the Aero Cobra's smooth, unbroken curve of the underside, and almost straight top to the fuselage. Pilot's cockpit well forward. Here she comes, low wings, with an almost straight leading edge, and a long pointed nose too. Now you can get an eyeful of the long tapered nose and those straight tapered wings set very far back, almost halfway to the tailplane, which incidentally shows a noticeable cut out of it. There she goes, with slim fuselage and smooth underside. Now let's spot her in flight. A long nose to smell out the enemy wherever he may be. Almost straight leading edge, and look at those wings, well back, aren't they? Now we've got her for certain. Nose up, wings halfway back, and clean underside to wings and fuselage. Away she goes, and a final glimpse of the smooth curve to the underside of the fuselage. Let's look closer and see what we can find out. The straight line to the top of the fuselage broken by the smooth curve of the cockpit. Cockpit is forward of the leading edge. The fuselage is broken too by the air intake behind the cockpit. Most unusual. A nicely rounded tail fin and rudder. And that graceful smooth curve underneath giving you nose up appearance. Yes, the Aero Cobra is nose up, isn't she? That's a very definite point to look for. Here's a view which calls for quick identification. Now, what have we got? Oval nose, with cockpit showing above. Smooth underside to wings, because radiators are set in the leading edge. Wings have dihedral from roots, and tailplane set high. Dead on, but dead easy. That's the Aero Cobra, all right. Take a look at that long nose. What a schnozzle. Ah, cha -cha 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 -cha. Is he mortified? Here you can see that wings placed well back, unusual for a fighter, and leading edge almost straight make it an easy one to spot. And to resolve any final doubts, nose up, and smooth, curved underside. Air a cobra for certain. And before she disappears, slim fuselage with clean underside, and the length of that schnozzle can even be seen from here, a view the Hun won't often see. So if in doubt, remember, straight top to fuselage, graceful, smooth, curve to underside, nose up in flight, which is long and slender, She's an Aero Cobra, and another Anglo-American blow to the Nazis.